Hey guys, it's Kara. Okay, so the first topic for this week, actually I think almost all of these topics were sent in by people, which is fantastic. This is the, I think the first time this has really happened. Um, okay, so the first topic that we have is about self-defense. Um, self-defense can be really important, especially for uh, women and members of the LGBT community, because women are the people who are most susceptible to being raped, and if you don't have a method of self-defense, if there's no one near you, you've got a problem. So that can be really important for them. And then for members of the LGBT community, um, a lot of them are subject to really violent hate crimes, as awful as that is. And so even though you shouldn't have to be prepared for this, like you're better off being prepared to defend yourself from people who are trying to hurt you. I mean, it can save your life. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, the second thing for this week, uh, am I single? No. Just so, in case you were still, you know, doubting me, go check back a couple videos of mine, you'll see one of me and my boyfriend. Um, the follow-up question to that, uh, since I'm not single, um, why am I with my significant other? His name is Jaren. Um, there are a lot of reasons. Uh, he makes me feel safe. He supports me. Uh, Jared believes in me when I don't even believe in me. And trust me, there are a lot of those times. Um, he loves me without s having any conditions, without anything like that. He takes care of me. Uh, he forgives me time and time again. I mess up a lot. I mean, I'm nowhere close to perfect. And he's, he's forgiven me every time. I, I can comfortably be myself around him. Like, I don't feel like I need to have all my makeup on. Like, I don't have to always look perfect. Like, he's seen me at my worst, and he still loves me. So, I'm able to relax and be me. Um, and the list just goes on and on and on. I have so many reasons to be with him, and I'm really lucky to be with him. Um, okay. My favorite article of clothing. I momentarily forgot about this. So give me a moment while I get it. Oh no. Okay. Mm. Sorry about that. This. This right here. This is the dress that I wore on Valentine's Day. I'm in love with it. <clears throat> I love frilly clothing. I really, really, really... It's kind of a problem. Um, okay, and then the last thing that I'm supposed to do is tell my favorite joke. I don't really know a whole lot of jokes. <coughs> I can really think of one right now. And I'm not sure if I'm going to get it right. So bear with me. Okay. So there's an atheist and he's walking through the woods. And he's looking around at all of this beautiful nature around him and he's like, Oh, this is all so beautiful, and it all came to be completely by chance. Um, so as he's walking through this forest, a bear comes out, and it looks like it's about to attack him. So the atheist drops to his knees, and he's like, God, if you exist, please make this bear a Christian. Because I'm not going to become a Christian, but if he becomes a Christian, maybe he won't eat me. Okay, so God agrees. And, um, so the bear stops. And then the bear gets on his knees and he folds his paws and he says, Dear Lord, please bless the meal I'm about to receive. The end. I hope it was hilarious. Okay, I'll talk to you guys next week. I uh, hope y'all have a good week. Uh, don't forget, you can submit questions to our email. I'll put that underneath my video. You can also talk to me on my Tumblr. Uh, which I'll also put the link to under here. And, yeah, that's about it. Cheers!